and today I'm going to be doing Rich Dad Poor Dad. Chapter 6 Summary. And the lesson is work to learn, don't work for money. So the chapter summary the chapter summary was Robert was an interview was interviewed a few years ago in Singapore by a journalist who over the course of their conversation revealed that she wanted to become a best selling author like him. But her novels, which everyone said were excellent, never went anywhere. Robert suggested that she take a course in sales training that that offended the reporter who said she had a master's degree in English literature and didn't see how learning to sell would help her. In fact, she hated, she hated salespeople. When Robert pointed out that he's a best-selling author, not a best-writing author, she replied she would never stoop so low as to learn to sell and left the interview. There are talented people all around us who struggle financially just like that reporter. In one of in the words of one business consultant, they are one skill away from greatness. What that means is that too many of us specialize. If we would learn and master just one skill, our income would jump exponentially. When it comes to money, the only skill most people know is to work hard. If that reporter took some courses in ad copywriting as well as sales, then a job at an advert then get a job at an advertising agency. She'll learn how to get a million, get millions in free publicity, a skill she could put to turning her next novel into a bestseller. When Robert came out with his first book, If You Want to Be Rich and Happy, Don't Go to School, a publisher suggested that he change the title to The Economics of Education, but Robert knew that title wouldn't sell. Even though he is pro-education, he chose a title that was controversial because it knew, he knew it would get him on TV and radio shows, and it worked. Okay, so that's chapter 5 summary. I'll be doing chapter 6 next. So like and subscribe. Bye!